in order to, para, con el fin de. Estoy haciendo este ejercicio para mejorar mi inglés. I'm doing this exercise in order to improve my English. I'm doing this exercise in order to improve my English. Ahorró dinero para comprar un auto nuevo. He saved money in order to buy a new car. He saved money in order to buy a new car. Me desperté temprano para tener un buen desayuno. I woke up early in order to have a good breakfast. I woke up early in order to have a good breakfast. Estudió mucho para aprobar el examen. She studied hard in order to pass the exam. She studied hard in order to pass the exam. Trabajaron horas extras para terminar el trabajo. They worked overtime in order to finish the job. They worked overtime in order to finish the job. By the time. Para cuando. Para decir que pasó mucho o demasiado tiempo. Para cuando llegué a casa, ya estaba oscuro. By the time I got home, it was already dark. By the time I got home, it was already dark. Para cuando llegamos al restaurante, todas las mesas estaban ocupadas. By the time we arrived at the restaurant, all the tables were taken. By the time we arrived at the restaurant, all the tables were taken. Instead of, en lugar de, decidí dar un paseo en lugar de ver la televisión. I decided to take a walk instead of watching TV. I decided to take a walk instead of watching TV. Ella eligió comer una ensalada en lugar de una hamburguesa. She chose to have a salad instead of a burger. She chose to have a salad instead of a burger. Decidimos ir a la playa en lugar del parque. We decided to go to the beach instead of the park. We decided to go to the beach instead of the park. En lugar de comprar un libro, tomé prestado uno de la biblioteca. Instead of buying a book, I borrowed one from the library. Instead of buying a book, I borrowed one from the library. As if, como si. Se comportó como si no le importara. He acted as if he didn't care. He acted as if he didn't care. Actuó como si nada hubiera pasado. She acted as if nothing had happened. She acted as if nothing had happened. Habló como si fuera un experto. He spoke as if he were an expert. He spoke as if he were an expert.
as long as, siempre y cuando. Puedes tomar prestado mi carro siempre y cuando lo devuelvas mañana. You can borrow my car as long as you bring it back tomorrow. You can borrow my car as long as you bring it back tomorrow. Puedes venir a la fiesta siempre y cuando te comportes. You can come to the party as long as you behave. You can come to the party as long as you behave. Puedes quedarte despierto hasta tarde siempre y cuando termines tu tarea. You can stay up late as long as you finish your homework. You can stay up late as long as you finish your homework. Even if, aun si, incluso si, incluso si recibo un aumento, no me quedo. Even if I get a raise, I'm not staying. Even if I get a raise, I'm not staying. Aun si me invitan, no voy. Even if they invite me, I'm not going. Even if they invite me, I'm not going. Incluso si eso significa que perdamos, debemos hacer lo correcto. Even if it means we lose, we must do what is right. Even if it means we lose, we must do what is right. Now that, ahora que, ahora que dejó de llover, podemos salir a dar un paseo. Now that it stopped raining, we can go for a walk. Now that it stopped raining, we can go for a walk. Ahora que he terminado mi trabajo, puedo relajarme y ver una película. Now that I have finished my work, I can relax and watch a movie. Now that I have finished my work, I can relax and watch a movie. Out of, fuera de, sin, no queda leche. We are out of milk. We are out of milk. Nos quedamos sin gasolina. We ran out of gas. We ran out of gas. La impresora no tiene tinta. The printer is out of ink. The printer is out of ink. La máquina expendedora está fuera de servicio. The vending machine is out of order. The vending machine is out of order. So that, para qué? Ahorramos dinero para poder tomar unas vacaciones. We saved money so that we could take a vacation. We saved money so that we could take a vacation. Estoy empacando esta noche para poder salir temprano en la mañana. I'm packing tonight so that I can leave early in the morning. I'm packing tonight so that I can leave early in the morning. En case of, en caso de, este es el número para llamar en caso de emergencia. This is the number to call in case of emergency. This is the number to call in case of emergency. El letrero decía, en caso de incendio, usar escaleras. 
The sign said, In case of fire, use stairs. The sign said, In case of fire, use stairs. Do tu. Debido a. Se canceló el vuelo debido al mal tiempo. The flight was canceled due to bad weather. The flight was canceled due to bad weather. Algunas carreteras están cerradas debido a la inundación. Some roads are closed due to the flood. Some roads are closed due to the flood. According to, según, según el médico, estás anémico. According to the doctor, you are anemic. According to the doctor, you are anemic. Todo va según lo previsto. Everything is going according to schedule. Everything is going according to schedule. Según el pronóstico, mañana hará sol. According to the forecast, it will be sunny tomorrow. According to the forecast, it will be sunny tomorrow. In front of, delante de, en frente de. El auto delante de mí se detuvo de repente. The car in front of me stopped suddenly. The car in front of me stopped suddenly. Aparqué frente a tu casa. I parked in front of your house. I parked in front of your house. Tuve que recitar un poema delante de la clase. I had to recite a poem in front of the class. I had to recite a poem in front of the class. Ahead of, delante de, por delante. Tienes toda tu vida por delante. You have your whole life ahead of you. You have your whole life ahead of you. El avión está adelantado. The plane is ahead of schedule. The plane is ahead of schedule. ¿Cuántas personas están delante de mí? How many people are ahead of me? How many people are ahead of me? In agreement with, de acuerdo con, los padres estaban de acuerdo con el maestro. The parents were in agreement with the teacher. The parents were in agreement with the teacher. Estamos todos de acuerdo con su decisión. We are all in agreement with their decision. We are all in agreement with their decision. In favor of, a favor de, ¿Cuántos están a favor de pedir pizza? How many are in favor of ordering pizza? How many are in favor of ordering pizza? El tribunal falló a favor del acusado. The court ruled in favor of the defendant. The court ruled in favor of the defendant. In spite of, 
a pesar de, pese de, a pesar de ser pobres, son felices. In spite of being poor, they are happy. In spite of being poor, they are happy. A pesar de sus diferencias, siguen siendo amigos. In spite of their differences, they remain friends. In spite of their differences, they remain friends. Other than, aparte de, aparte de eso es perfecto. Other than that, it's perfect. Other than that, it's perfect. ¿A quién has invitado, aparte de la familia? Who have you invited, other than family? Who have you invited, other than family? Nadie más que tú puede acceder a la cuenta. The account can't be accessed by anyone other than you. The account can't be accessed by anyone other than you. Mm-hmm.